Well, he was the cross in central New York, you know. He set the tempo from the uh, late 60s through the 70s and 80s. That was Roy Simmons Jr. a short time ago remembering the great Richie Moran. The Cornell lacrosse legend passed away over the weekend at the age of 85. Moran and Simmons coached against each other for many years. They ended up becoming great friends, but that wasn't always the case. They were the two finalists for the same high school job back in 1961, and their rivalry continued into the college game with Simmons at Syracuse and Moran at Cornell. The Big Red dominated the series at first, but the tide turned in the 80s. And while the two men didn't talk much early on during their competitive rivalry, things did change for the better. And then one day he came to me and he said, you know, we shouldn't shake hands, we shouldn't shake hands anymore. And I said, no, you're probably right, we shouldn't. He said, no, and he reached out and that big Irish smile, and he wrapped his arms around me and gave me a big hug. He said, this is what I think about you. And I wrapped my arms around Richie and I said, this is what I think about you. And from then on, it was a thing between Richie and I. We never shook hands again. We only hugged. We don't shake hands, we hug. And he talked about that right up to the end. The two remained close for the last several decades. Richie Moran won three national titles at Cornell. He survived by his wife, son, and two daughters. We'll have much more on the passing of Richie Moran tomorrow on Orange Nation from 7 to 7.30 right here on News Channel 9.